Okay, I've arrived at my next stop. I'm super excited about it. Don't want to waste any more time uh, enjoying the beautiful scenery and Christmas decorations out here. Let's go in and see what we can find. Every booth is fully loaded. What is this bell box? That's kind of neat. 488. 1980. It's kind of cool. I think I can do a little bit better though. Hmm, little cat figurine. Cute. Eight dollars. Not bad. Hmm. Little Santa roly poly. I've had those before. They don't sell for that much. Well, I just spotted. Ah, I spotted a chalkware Santa. What? love this six dollars i'm definitely gonna take this i don't think i've seen one quite like this before and i'm really into this plate here it looks almost like george briard oh i also see this this is kind of fun i've seen these before but um i'm honestly scared to ship them i'm scared to handle them either i'm, I'm kind of messy but very cute that's probably my favorite one i have seen whoa what's going on in here see the head vases $40 each for the Barbara's those are kind of nice I see them a lot honestly I'm kind of kind of into this hat and of course the glittery hair dryer chair I'm not sure why I'm so into this the font is kind of fun huh I don't need that ah, look at this squirrely thing I know it's a skunk but how fabulous $30 man that's a really fair price too. Like now that I'm moving, I think I have a little bit of a yard. I might have fun with it, but not today. I don't even feel like picking that up. It's very heavy. Spotted a Snow White planter in here. Oh, and it's not locked. I love that. 33. We're gonna put that back. Hazel Atlas. Uh, or is it Hazel Atlas? clowns they're only eight dollars each fun but if it was for the pair i'd do it just because i'm super cheap <laughs> that's a really fair price they can go for a lot but um, i'm not willing to spend that much on that today considering all i'm finding oh look here's a little angel tree topper in the original packaging and she's blue how cute six bucks new old stock i'd be crazy if I didn't pick that up. Ooh, super into this hat. $29. Not for me. I don't need it. I end up uh, buying these hats for myself and wearing them maybe once and selling them. Uh-oh, I hear the pitter-patter of some serious rain coming down. What's going on over here? Wait, wait, wait. Oh, these are new. I thought they, you know, I'm still caught up on those uh, Inarco Italy Christmas bulbs I saw the other day when I was in Phoenix. Oh, I really like the boxes on these. Another little elf, $10, not bad. I'm gonna pass on that one. These are kind of fun. Ooh, and these lamps, I never see them ceramic. I usually just see the plastic. Oh, it. that's strange. Strange are those, they are ceramic. Very cool, very inexpensive too. $25 each. Oh, got another Santa Claus here. He's pretty spectacular, 18. Not bad, he's in really good condition for a collector. That's a steal, maybe not for resale. These candle lights are pretty neat too. 20 bucks, again, a little too close for me. Speaking of George Briard, check out this freaking frying pan. Holy crap, that's cool. Oh my gosh. I've never seen one like that. I'd be scared to use it though. I kind of want to look it up just, just because. Just because I've never seen one. So there's a couple on... Uh, 
eBay right now for 30. I'm sorry, I got distracted because I just noticed that this towel says butt face. Um, anyway, there's a couple on eBay right now between 28 and 30. So I'm going to go ahead and leave that, but I'm going to snap a pic of this and send it to a friend. Milk. Milk. <laughs> I was about to say Milky Mickey. Ew. <laughs> Uh, $7 fair price again. I've had this one before. Didn't sell for that much. It did sell pretty quick, but I'm going to keep looking. Very cool mid-century booth. Gosh, it's like a lot going on here. What is the design on these? Oh, they're roosters. Oh, oh my gosh, look at him. He's so funny. Oh, I love this little cat figurine. That is too cute, $9, not bad at all. I could still make a couple bucks off that. Kinda looks like whole Howard. I'm not sure if it's worth taking it apart just to see if I'm right, but old Howard, huh, never seen that before. Very cool, 17 bucks. Okay, there's a lot happening in this booth. I'm gonna dig for Something spectacular. Sounds like the rain stopped. Love that for me. There's one of the Valentine's Day ones. Nope. Oh, there it is. Yeah. I've had that before. Oh, so many good ones. What's this bag? This one's got a little nurse and a ballerina. I'm not going to go crazy over here because honestly, it's still have had a slow time with a lot of the dolls and I've had a lot of these before and I'm waiting to go back to that Christmas booth. Whoa, look at this. Uh, this looks like Murano. That definitely looks like Murano. I don't know the most about, oh, it's got a broken leg. I was gonna say it's only $10. There's something wrong with it and there is. Well, these are generally hilarious. <laughs> Only a dollar. I don't think they have much resale value, but they're fantastic. Also notice this weird little, huh, that's really interesting. It's only a dollar. It's a tennis angel. I've never seen that before. Hmm, very cool. Um, I love this thermometer. Looks about right too, it's cold in here. 20 bucks, just kidding. I am obsessed with this dragon. How freaking neat is that thing? Paper mache. Oh, and of course the daisy clock, which I'm just now noticing. That is a really cool vase. I think it's a decanter though. A lot going on over here too. I've had one of these for a long time. I'm surprised it hasn't sold yet. If it had, I would have picked that one up for five bucks too. Hmm. Salt and peppers, snowmen, ten dollars, not bad. It's just a hobbyist set. Oh, these lions are fun. I think these are uh, Holt Howard too, actually. Although I haven't had much luck with that style. Ew, what's this rooster bowl? <laughs> Italy, that's kind of neat. There's one of those weird ducks. Another Holt Howard set. Oh, no, that's so funny. It's made to look like Holt Howard, but it's Italian. How strange. No, okay, so I'm not crazy. The bottom one's Holt Howard. This one's Holt Howard and the middle one's Italy. That makes me feel better. I thought it was crazy for a second. What's going on here? These have a strange look to them. They look like Repop, 25. Mm. I love this little, is that what I think it is? Look at the whole push, $45. I'm not even gonna get attached to it. What is this funky guy? <laughs> and I love the box on these. I'm not a crazy Tweety Bird person, and this is obviously new, but I kind of like the Roy Lichtenstein style of it. It's plastic. It's kind of weird, huh? I love Roy Lichtenstein, one of my favorite artists. Cute little children's chair. And more Christmas though, more reproduction stuff. Although I noticed this angel wall hanging, $10. I 
That's more than I'd like to spend on that. There's a lot happening here. Again, more reproduction, but it's kind of a mixed bag, so it's more fun to look. There's this random nun over here. How much are you? Five dollars. Hmm. Eh, I've done that a few times recently. Whoa, so much strawberry shortcake. Wish I knew more about it, and other than the fact that it's generally collectible. What are these little buttons? How cute. What is this little bag? Little pigs and bunnies, hobbyist pieces, cute. One of those potato sour cream servers without the lid. Oh, and it's a candle dang. I was gonna say that's adorable. What's that hiding up here? Interesting. It's got some damage. It's marked Italy. I feel like I could probably still make a couple bucks off that, but I have a feeling it's gonna be one of those things when I take it into the light, I'm gonna notice more and more damage. I'm already seeing more than I'd like. 